All right, so today I'm gonna to replace the hard drive in a Dell Latitude E4300 with a solid state drive. First thing I'm going to do is remove the battery. Make sure that's not plugged in. I use a pick and a screwdriver. Uh, the pick really is just, these screws are kind of hard to get out. So you can use the pick to kind of help it out there. And you're looking for the two screws on the bottom. Some laptops have one, some have four. This one has two. And once you get these screws out, you'll notice that there is a sliding hard drive caddy and you can just pull it out. And this is your hard drive. I actually already had a solid state drive in this laptop, uh, but I'm going to replace it with the Crucial C300. It is a little bit faster, um, so that's why I'm upgrading. Both of them are very good solid state drives. I highly recommend them. I have uh, the larger C300 in my desktop. And while this Kingston model is not the fastest on the market, it's extremely reliable. So if you're looking to get your first solid state drive, I would definitely say that you should go for one of these. Now, what I just did was remove the one screw holding this piece in, and then it pops out. And that's all you need to do on these Dell models. So it's very easy to uh, replace the hard drive or upgrade to a solid state drive. Keep in mind that when you replace the hard drive in uh, a laptop or any computer, you will be losing all your files and your operating system. So be prepared to reinstall. So I've secured the caddy back onto the SSD and it is gonna slide right in like that. You're gonna hear it click in there. And then all you need to do is reinstall the two screws and you are ready to install your operating system. And that's how easy it is. That's all you have to do.